because this is the first vacuum I have ever owned. Actually, a lot of my things are the first thing that I've ever owned, but this is my first very adult purchase. And it looks like a weapon. It's very sleek, all white, and I've heard of this brand for ages. I hear this brand is pretty good. So excited you guys because my new dining set just came so it's a bar table i actually got them from dragon mart and they are just so classy so aside from that we also got these new packages from Moon. y'all i moved some stuff around brought everything that i ordered in and i can't wait to show you guys around let's go so when you first walk into my tiny space you are greeted with the kitchen over here are a few appliances that i've collected this is an air fryer and a kettle for my water and i also found this from dragon mart it's supposed to be a place where you put like all your little knickknacks in like your keys and stuff um, but I use it for receipts. And then over here are a bunch of snacks, pastry, quick food. I don't want to show you the state of my fridge because it is a mess in there. <laughs> so let's head over to this small cooking area. I have this induction cooker, I think you would call it. Um, only because I didn't want to get a stove, I didn't want to pay for gas. And I don't cook often anyways. This does the job very well. I also have this. I would advise against purchasing these actually. Although they are very cute and complete. Um, they melt pretty easily. So it's not really suitable for cooking. Because it is made out of silicon. And this is the dish rack from earlier as well. It has done its job. It's lovely. And that is just my sink. Yep. That is what my small kitchen looks like. I love the cabinets. I love everything about it. It's very perfect for me. Over here is where I placed my full body mirror. I am thinking of hanging it onto the wall just for extra space. And I have my little swivel chair over here. And I built this with Gab, so it's very special to me. Even though it doesn't have its own place in the space yet, I've kept it because it matches the interior anyway. And Mac really loves sleeping on this, so... I'm not getting rid of it anytime soon. Next up is my bed and the sheets look very off-white right now because my cat sheds a lot of fur so <laughs> it isn't as white as I want it to be but it still looks great. Um, I got this textured print from Dragon Mart. I got all of the pillows from there for really cheap and I love it. It's so cozy and even though it's summertime, it's not too hot in there. Like It's very breathable still. I am thinking of getting a few prints like over there perhaps and over there just to liven up the space even more but for now I think this will have to do. Over in this tiny space is Max's bed. He likes to sleep here if he's not sleeping on the bed with me and I swear I, when I bought this it, it was purely white. Now it's a bit beige or gray. I don't know what color that is but still it makes a comfortable bed for him. That's all that matters. Now this statement piece is my couch. I really love it. It's actually just my height. So I love napping on here. It's very soft. It's very cozy. I am also thinking of adding some prints above it. Another statement piece is this coffee table. It's glass on top and gold on the bottom and that's the main reason why I bought it. It matches so well with the couch. I really love how the legs are designed. Like it's so chic and I got it on sale and I love it a lot. This is my podcast ready setup. Not that I'm thinking of starting one anytime soon, but it does look perfect for a show or a podcast. I got this table. I told you guys, I got everything from Dragon Mart and Mac just loves this area because he likes looking at the view. And earlier, this whole setup was over here, but then my mom said, maybe move it to the window. And I have not looked back since. It's such a great place to work. And again, Mac loves this place. Hi, Mac. 
Yes, meow indeed. One nice thing about the space are also these built-in cabinets. I love the texture on these so much. They kind of look like linen up close. I love them, I love them, I love them. Last but not least, these are my floor-to-ceiling windows and it's just so nice to see my cat here, you know, basking in the sun. That's his little toy and his scratcher over there. And that's Mac. He's so sweet. His name is Mac. So I did miss out on showing you guys my bathroom. There is a lot of work that still needs to be done. So maybe I'll do a separate video on that. But so far, I hope you guys like the space as much as I do. I hope I was able to give you some pieces of inspiration. And I hope you guys tune in for the next one. Bye!